everything goes wrong. He missed the main show. He missed the anniversary of the game. Joe Harrison, the Sulu Attitudes are now the world champions. And Ty Tyson. Ty Tyson. I am not done with Ty Tyson. Not by a long shot. But I came here for one reason besides to help put on a great show. Last time I was here, I offered one of you redneck hillbillies $20. And I saw how far you people go to a tour. There she is. There she is. Let's, let's hear for the one fan. That... So, I have a question today. Who wants to win $20? If it's anything like the last time, I'll pass. I'm not so that desperate. This time, oh, you want to win $20, little kid? You don't even know what you're going to do. How about this? I pay you $20 to pass school. Oh, wait, you're probably going to fail. <laughs> hey, that's my joke. Don't laugh at it. Terry, open up, and let's see what we've got today for these people to earn. That's a little different attire on Timmy, I'll give him credit, besides being that referee outfit. So, oh, no, I no have way. American made pedigree dog food. Good. And I've got $20 that says you will eat this dog food. So, who wants $20? Ma'am, do you want twenty dollars? I'm pretty sure you do. Twenty dollars? Oh, you probably want that night with Kevin Phoenix instead. I'm sure. I twenty dollars. I would. I'd eat the dog food first. What? Well, you have to eat. You have to take a yes. You have to take a bite of the dog food. Ma'am, I understand you want to go again and get more money for your family. Let the rest of these broke little buildings get a chance. $20. Do you want it? $20? All right, come on. We have a lucky winner, so come on down. I've got $20 right here. Hey, you people know twenty dollars is twenty dollars. Come on, don't act like you haven't done a lot less for free, okay? I'll give Kevin a dollar if he'll shut up and leave. It'll take a lot more than that. Go get him, Nana. Somewhere Ted DiBiase's got me getting a laugh out of this. Oh, yeah. Ma'am, what is your name? Nina. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear for Nina. Come on! Now, it wouldn't be a Kevin Phoenix surprise if I didn't throw one little uh, stipulation in there. Not only do you have to eat this dog food, but I'm gonna lay here in the middle of the ring and you're gonna eat it off my chest. <laughs> Good. Oh my God. Uh, I don't, I you shouldn't, say? I shouldn't laugh. What but... you say? Okay. She says, okay, Tony Bowers, eating dog food off of my chest. Tell me what you That might have been more incentive. He might, have, he, might have, he might have had more takers if he had said that at the first. I'll even, I'll even let you take the shirt off of me. How about that? I'll add the extra bonus. You can take the shirt off me yourself. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. That's what happens when you go to Vegas. 
Timmy, the dog food, please. I'll give, I'll give you a dog food. Right here in the area of Delaware proves anything can happen. I broke it. I broke it. I broke it. I got too excited. I popped my can too early. I hate it when that happens. Oh, that just tires me up. I'm sorry. Don't worry, it happens to everybody. Yep. But he came prepared with a spare. Yeah, you would know he would. Breathe it in, ladies and gentlemen. Let's hear it. Come on. Cheer. Cheer for us. Let's go through it. Come on. It's going to be good. When you're watching this, I hope you've already had your dinner or your lunch or breakfast. Come on! Come on! Yes! Tony, give me the 20! Give me the 20, Tony! Yes! That proves that you people will do anything for 20 dollars! music there and I'm done. You, you people disgust me. You people disgust me. But me and Fighters Club had a little running 
his modeling agency agreed to let him uh, fight if he wore some kind of uh, headgear face protection. However, uh, I don't know if they're aware of uh, just how secure that uh, headgear is and how easily it can that it can be removed. Normally, when that type of headgear is worn in competition, it's a requirement, and if it falls off, it's it's put back on. Oh, uh-oh. Oh, finally. You better hope the modeling agency doesn't find out that he is uh, uh, taking that uh, taking that protective headgear off. But you know one thing about it, though. The Fighters Club are one of the top teams right now in line for those world tag team titles. Oh, yeah. And, when, yeah, and by the way, we're hoping the best for Mickey Pope and the other Damon Bryce, if we hear anything, wrestling yeah. fans, we'll pass it along to you. Yeah, we certainly will. Yeah, that's uh, uh, professional wrestling is a very dangerous sport. And like we said, you know, trained professionals like those two men uh, can get hurt. So, uh, you know, if that can happen, then uh, somebody that doesn't know what they're doing, you know, like kids or, you know, or, or even adults. Exactly. You know, just one slip of the foot, that's all it takes. That's right. And, uh, I mean, and it's nobody's fault. Oh, it's, no. It's no. just something that in this business, and in this sport, stuff like that can happen. Oh, yeah. That's and, right. and the thing is, too, just goes every to time, show. and every man, uh, and every, every person uh, that steps in, through those ropes, step in with the understanding that they could be oh. Oh. That's got to hurt right there. Purple nurple, double purple nurple. Oh. Oh, oh my God. Goodness. They better not take Buddy too lightly. That's for sure. Oh, Buddy. Oh, no. oh, oh, really oh, taking it to right. Parrish. Not going for the cover yet. It's probably a good idea. It's a little early for going for a cover. However, he's walking oh, back and forth. Nice oh. elbow there by Flowers. Yeah, hey, just a one. Like I said, I I think uh, you know, one of the advantages Buddy Flowers has is uh, a lot of people, you know, he comes out with the funny music. He comes out with the... You know, with the dancing and stuff, I think uh, a lot of people uh, make the mistake of not taking him seriously. Oh, oh, nice no, double team nice. maneuver there. Very unorthodox, but very effective. Ah, goodness. Yeah, like I said, Flowers, he's, he's a little unorthodox when that bell rings. It's a different demeanor. Nice deep arm oh, right there. Caden kick. Nice knees right there. Right under the chin. Yeah, like I said earlier, rat, wrestling fans and guys. Oh, what double knee to the head! Jack, Jack screaming to David Parrish to move, but he was he was out. He probably wasn't hearing a thing. That's true. Uh, when uh, you know, taking all that punishment. But yeah, like I said earlier, you know, Pierre, he's been on the roll and around the this, the south and around the country, winning titles everywhere else. Now he's back here now at WF, seeking more gold again. And I hope he, you know, he couldn't get it. Oh, oh nice leg drop with Flowers right there. Come on, oh, and the referee trying to get uh, Pierre out of the ring. That's right. And that, that, that finally cost Buddy Flowers that one little millisecond that he needed. But we can't forget the X Factor over here. And one Miss, Mr. and Mrs. Fighters Club over here. Just wait for them to get involved. Kane very smart there with the distraction. Yep. Giving uh, David Parrish just a few seconds to recover, and that's all it took. Now, now the Fighters Club is uh, uh, is, in, is uh, well controlled this matchup after uh, taking a beating for several minutes. Uh, Flowers and Pierre both did a really good job. Oh, nice oh, drop, drop kick there. You can hear that impact. 
You got to get credit where credit is due. Parrish and Kane are a formidable tag team. Oh, definitely. And they're still young. They still got a lot of improvement to go. Yes, the fact that they're holding, uh, they're holding a prestigious title like the AIWF Mid Atlantic Tag Team Titles at such a young age is a testament to, to what great athletes they are. However, uh, again, there's that there's that blemish uh, on their title reign of having all the outside interference from other members of the Fighters Club, which again, they probably wouldn't even need if they uh, chose to just go at it on their own. What in the world is Jack doing? Oh, Jack, he's, uh, yeah, he's popping the parish's back. Trying to, he's trying to work out the, uh, work out the kinks. Right. right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. good. Nice. Jack looks like he might be getting a little frustrated with, uh, uh, -huh. uh with, uh, Kane and Parrish. Yeah, they've got, like, again, yeah, they had the match well under control right now, but I think he's, uh, he, he may be getting frustrated that the match isn't over yet. He might be expecting Well, here we go. Had to stick yeah. his nose in. It's just a matter of time. Should have known. And Cade. Should have known he stick his nose in. Yep. And Cade and Pierre trying to stop trying to stop the outside interference, but uh, only causing more problems for his uh, partner. That's right, but it's just infuriating Cade. We see what happens when he gets aggravated. Yeah. And it's getting ready to happen. Oh, nice. Snap here with a kick oh. right there. And now working on that knee. Oh. Yeah, the Fighters Club uh, doing the smart thing by. Uh, oh, look at that leverage right there. What would you call that? A half cramp? Yeah, yeah, you're right. Half cramp. Yeah, it's a half cramp, but also. He's adding uh, he's adding extra leverage by putting the knee in the uh, in the side of Flowers' back, causing even more um, causing even more punishment. Flowers right. very close to the ropes, trying to reach out to them, but just a little too far. Flowers desperate goes for the hair. Oh, oh pounding in that knee. You know, ACL, MCL muscles both right now got to be a little sore and tender. Oh, definitely. Yeah, the Fighters Club, you know, they're, they are known for their speed. However, uh, oh, the crowd getting into it. Flowers oh, he's with some devastating elbows. There go. They're just getting into a slugfest here. Back in there. Oh, nice oh, kick there. Oh, good. Oh, yeah. Pierre is foaming at the mouth to get in there. Yeah. Figure four. Oh. If that leg wasn't damaged enough already, that's going to make it even worse. This could be it right here. Yeah, Flowers is definitely going to have to kick it in. Ah, oh, he's biting the can. Oh, if it works, go for it. Okay, Kane made it over to Paris. Flowers. Hey, buddy, make it. Oh, he's at, he turned the wrong way. Yeah. He's probably in so much pain right now, he has no idea where he is in the That's ring right. right now. He was distracted. Unfortunately, he's fighting. Oh, whoa, what's he up to? Easy, buddy. Nice oh, maneuver there. The neck breaker from the top rope. If he were able, if he hadn't taken so much damage throughout this matchup, if he were able to make the pin immediately, Right. He would pro we would probably have new tag team champions right now. Yeah, he was actually, he was actually right. Flowers with oh, the tag! We got he got the tag to Pierre! Oh, now Pierre is on fire! Pierre's Double four for Oh, he oh, owes it. Oh, nice! Oh, super kick! Oh, there goes the acrobatics! Oh, oh, right into the rib cage. Oh, that's a leg sweep. Uh-oh. 
We got action outside the ring also. And the thing is, those acrobatics, with every one of those flips, oh. he just adds more and more momentum. Oh man, Parrish has flowers just running in that turnbuckle. Stink face from Pierre and Kane though. Jack wishing that was him. So I guess they're calling him the B word. That's right. Hey, fellas, Up on his hey, hey, what's he got? Oh, oh no! Clara! Oh, my oh, God! Razor. David Parrish just tased! Just tased Caden Pierre! This is just uncalled for. Two, three, oh! You've got to be kidding me! Talk about a shocking finish. Just when you think the fighters were up against too many lower. They just tased the leg of Caden Pierre. That gives new work, leading to a shocking 